and welcome to my channel and if you are new welcome on in I am Simarella and today we are here with the troublemaker scenario so this is my teen and her name is Tessa and let me tell you a little bit about the troublemaker scenarios one of the new scenarios that the Sims have put out and basically the goal is to be well adjusted there are two the teen is at least a B minus student and has five friends academic excellence is of course if your teen is a A minus student and above and then down below bad influence teen has done at least one school prank successfully so that is your goal for the scenario and here here's the description um, the difficulty is easy and it says moving to a new town and a new school could be a fresh start for a teen who's been more interested in causing mayhem than doing homework up until now. Will this teen turn things around and improve their grades at their new school or turn the school upside down with more mischief? And on top of that, I also added in some extra challenges. You know how I like drama. We all like drama. So I made my own extra challenge and I'm going to share that with you right now. Here is my extra challenge uh, to go along with this scenario. And the extra challenges, it says, this challenge goes with the Sims 4 Troublemaker scenario. Adding these extra challenges along with the scenario should make it a little bit more fun and add more drama to your gameplay. You must complete both of the extra challenges and the Troublemaker scenario. So here are the extra challenges. One, you start out the scenario with both parents upset at you. So you must make one of your parents your besties. Or, you know, become best friends with one parent. Two, get your teen sim to level five of mischief. Three, complete the leader of the pack aspiration. Uh, four, your sim, your teen must make an enemy and have one fight. Five, you must date more than one sim at the same time. Don't get caught, because if you do get caught, you must decide which one to apologize and mend with, and the other must no longer be your friend. And obviously, to win the end of the Extra Trouble Challenge, your sim must have one scholarship and get accepted into the college of your sim's choice. And of course, um, I will definitely um, have the link to this extra trouble challenge in my description below and if you decide to play along with me or do it at your leisure let me know how it's going and use the hashtag extra trouble challenge all right I have them in is Brentington Bay and that is with the you know the cats and dogs um, pack and they are here in this house um, and Tessa is just an only child and she is highly upset. She's so tense. But let me let you know a little bit more about Tessa. So let me pause. Okay, so Tessa obviously is a high school student. Her grade is an F. <laughs> um, she hasn't started on homework and all that stuff. But um, here is her aspiration, leader of the pack. She must start or join a club. And that will help with the teen has to have five friends and buy a club perk. So that's um, the aspiration to get you started. And let's see what's going on with her. Uh, her traits are hot-headed, insider, and obviously she wants to be leader of the pack. Uh, you know, already know her mom and dad. So let me introduce you to her mom and dad as well. So this is her dad. Her dad's name is Tim. Um, he's a bit childish. He's very lazy. And he's just a freaking goofball. 
Uh, <laughs> he wants to become a master chef, so he is in the culinary field as far as his career goes. And yeah, so that's Tim in a nutshell. And then her mother, her mother's name is Ella, and her mom is a total neat freak. She's a snob, and she's a little squeamish. Um, but she loves her family, and her goal is she's a critic, but her, her aspiration is to be a super parent, obviously. Try to help Tessa along, not to be such a troublemaker. All right, so let's get into it. Let's have some fun. And if you are new and you like what you see and you want to know more about Troublemaker, hit that subscribe button down below. Hit the bell to let you know some more. Um, content will definitely be on the way, so it, it will alert you. All right, so it is on a Sunday, so there's definitely no school. It's 10 something in the morning. Tessa is tense. She's in her parents' bedroom on the computer. So let's get her into a little bit of mischief. Um, with the extra challenge, we have to level it up to five. So let's see. Mm. Oh, she could blog about her feelings. Um, she is so tense. She's so upset. She can, let's have a look for homework answer keys. You know, let's try and get her on the right path. Uh, Ella is uncomfortable. Why is she uncomfortable? Just, ew, gross. Oh, Tim must have belched. You know, he's a total goofball. He loves to make his wife's life a little bit complicated. Don't get me wrong, they love each other, but it's just like, you know, I mean, he, he likes to have fun and stuff, and she's just totally stuck up. Let them talk it out. Okay, let's get back to Tessa. So Tessa's definitely going to need some friends, that's for sure. There is a park nearby, but she's totally stressed out. She's festering bitterness. Talk to dad and kind of like see if he can give you any type of advice. So first off, let's apologize to dad. Um, and then let's just generally talk and just, and just feel dad out and see what's going on. Maybe he can help you out. We can start a little mischief, but we don't want to do that with our parents because they are already in a bad place. Dad, and look at him. He is just not hearing it. She's like, Dad, you know, we just came to Bridgerton Bay, and you guys are still mad at me for what happened over in um, Willow, let's say Willow Creek. And, uh, yeah, I, I want things to change. And he's like, you always say that. You always promise you're going to change things. And she's like, Dad, but I'm just I'm just totally trying to have fun. There's Mom. She's listening in. And she's like, oh, my God. Dad is pissed. Oh, now Tessa is totally pissed off. She's really angry. It did not go well with her father. That is a hothead lesson. Tessa is a hothead. These Sims tend to be angry often to the I can't even see that uh, for the directment of those around them okay she's angry she's pissed off she's talking to herself in the mirror uh, yeah try to calm down Tessa try to calm down All right, let her calm down. Mom and Dad is talking. Mom's like, you know, Tim, you were just a little bit hard on Tessa. She is trying after all. Give her a chance. And he's like, I don't want to hear it. This girl should know better. Yeah, Mom walked away. He's pissed off. Everyone's just pissed off. Tim is like, I can't, I can't deal with these women in this house. He, they're driving him crazy. 
Uh, but he loves his wife, so. All right, Tim, like I said, wants to be a chef, so let him just study up his skills and and watch the cooking channel. All right, go ahead, Tim. Mom is a critic, so she likes to come over and look at things and, and criticize everything and everyone. All right, Tessa's in the green. She's feeling a little bit better. Let's take care of her knee. She's going to the bathroom. Wonderful. So after that, let's just, it's raining. It's always raining in Brentington Bay. But I see some people outside. So let's go introduce ourselves to the neighbors. So who is this over here? Okay. Let's introduce... Oh boy, you don't want to be friends with him. He is a hardcore drinker. This man is, this Sim is always at the bar. But Tessa's going to introduce herself because she's just trying to turn a new leaf. Where's Tessa? There she goes. All right. Hey guys, how are you? My name is Tessa. I just moved in. That lady doesn't look interested at all. She's like, bye. <laughs> it's like, hey, girl, what's going on? All right, Fang. Ask about her day. All right. Well, hopefully Tessa can meet some new friends when she goes to school tomorrow how about we practice a little bit of mischief let's share some conspiracy theories she Tessa always likes to push the boundaries uh, ooh, mm, and still with false confidence she's like you know, that outfit really is not the move, girl. <laughs> She's like, I don't even know how you can walk around here looking like that. It's, it's just not cool. But she's embarrassed now. Now she's embarrassed. An awkward encounter. Ugh, where can I hide? That was an awkward encounter. She's out of here. Tessa is going back home. She's just over it. All right, Tessa, maybe if you talk to your mom, because things didn't really work out with your dad, maybe mom can give you some, just a boost of something. Apologize. Let's take a picture with mom as well, because I know that works. All right, let's take a picture with mom. Um, that's a job. Hold on. Wait here. Take a picture. Take photo with mom. There goes Tim. He's the chef, so he's definitely cooking something up. It looks like some grilled cheese. She's like, Mom, you know, I tried to go outside and, and talk to people. And her mom is like, Tessa, you need to do more. It's not about socializing, Tessa. It's about getting your schoolwork done. And now Tessa, she's like, you know what, mom? Forget it. She's over it. She's totally pissed off. But let's see. Let's take a picture. Uh, she dislikes photography. Mm, so I guess Tessa won't be taking any more pictures. All right. Mother and daughter. God, they look so much alike. <laughs> All right, take these quick pictures. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Hopefully that helped their relationship just a little bit better, but it's going to take time. All right. All right, Tessa. How about you try to do homework? How about that? And maybe that will make your parents a little bit happy. Do homework, and then I'm going to have Dad kind of help Tessa with the homework because school starts tomorrow so she can get a little bit of a head start 
Damn, Dad, you didn't make anybody else food? That you, that looks really good. Oh, a BLT. Oh, I ain't had a BLT. Oh, yes, he did. All right, Dad. He made food for everybody. Go ahead, Tessa. Come over here, hon. And then eat something. Oh, she's not. Oh, I was about to say she's not going to sit with them. Have a seat with them. Talk to them. Oh, mom's getting up. She's mom is like, mm, I don't know if I want to deal with this drama today at all. All right, mom's cleaning up. You know, she's a neat freak. All right, dad is not even looking at Tessa. He's just so pissed off. Tessa, uh-oh. She's cursing. This is unacceptable, Tessa. Discipline the behavior firmly. Go ahead, Dad. No, young lady, where are you going? You know, I'm not going to have you talk, talk like that in my house. She left, that little brat. <laughs> she left. She is washing the dishes. She she wasn't hearing it. All right. So now Tessa, um, where's the homework? She probably left it in her room somewhere. Where was she? Yep, there she goes, right there. Do homework, and then I'm going to have Dad once again help Tessa with the homework. Try to mend. I don't know which one. Whichever one turns a little bit of green, that's the one she's going to be besties with. Okay. It's, it's okay, Tessa. She's like, Dad, can't you see I'm trying to do my homework? And he's like, good. I'm glad you're doing your homework. Finally. Um, this is the way I want it to be from now on. And she's like, oh, my God, you can't even freaking help me. And he's like, you have to learn some things on your own, hon. So... Yeah, it's a rough start, but hopefully things will work out. In the morning, Tessa is going to school, and hopefully she will have some new friends. Is mom going to talk to you? Oh, she finished her homework, so that's a plus. At least she did it. She ignored her mom. Her mom is so happy. Her mom has gotten a sentiment with Tim. Let's check that out. Let's open that up. Yeah, they deeply connected. They married. Of course they have a connection. Okay. Kudos. All right. So next time will be the morning time. Oh, they all actually, they all together. What's mom saying to you, Tessa? They're having a conversation. Seems like Tessa's like, okay, mom, I get it. I really do get it. Things will be different. She is stomping her feet. She is just so freaking annoyed. And her mom's really trying to be kind of kind of calm, kind of sweet. A little bit of encouragement. Oh, there she goes. Tessa is at it again. And mom is like, you know what, Tessa? I'm just not going to take it. I'm not going to take you talking to me that way. <laughs> Tessa got a little scared. Okay, mom is going in mom mode. Mm-hmm. And dad is back there acting like an idiot. Okay. <laughs> Tessa is like, oh, of course. Of course you take his side, mom. I'm just going to jam to this music right here. Okay, it is the next day. It's Monday morning. Um, Tessa and Tim are up. Tim is going to the kitchen to cook some breakfast. Ella is also up. She's going to the bathroom. And they're all getting ready because they both work today. And Tessa starts school, her brand new school, Brentington High. Oh, she's really pissed because you know what? Her dad pranked the damn toilet. You know, he's, he's childish and he's a prankster. So he got her back. Luckily, she's going to, uh, <laughs> she's going to take a shower. He totally pranked that toilet. She's totally pissed off. This is not how you want to start school. 
prank fury being caught out and humiliated like that causes Tessa a deep feeling of rage. All right, Tim is cooking up some eggs and toast. Mom is also taking a shower. Tessa's out. She's pissed. All right. Oh, she's going to talk to her mom about it. She's going to bitch about it to her mom. All right. But who am I? I'm not sure what I want to be when I grow up and all my friends seem to have figured it out. How do I figure it out myself? Well, we only have one choice. Pick something you like. And she likes to play games and be on the internet. So they already have her recording media center in her room. So um, hopefully she can make some recordings. Study some trends. Don't cook Tessa because what is she over here? Oh, she's going to kick the trash. All right. Okay, hon. Come get some food. Start your day off right. Okay, grab a serving. Everyone grab a serving family time before going off and achieving goals. Mom is always disgusted. All right, Tessa's pissed. <laughs> All right, family time. So how did you sleep? How did everyone sleep being in the new home, in a new place? And Tessa's like, Dad, I can't believe you prank the damn toilet. Matter of fact, Tessa's not, she's, she's ignoring them. She's on her phone. She's eating her food. Mom and Dad is talking. And then, you know, Mom is like kind of giving Dad the side eye. All right, they both start their new jobs. Hopefully, everyone has a good day today. All right, Tessa. Tessa's finished her food. She's just not going to take a plate. Oh, she took a plate. She's kind of responsible, so that's good. All right, Tessa. You know, you're going to have to get Dad back. Let's do a little mischief with Dad, since Dad is just being a butthead. Uh, let's tell dad. Let's scare dad. See what happens. Dad is always dancing. Hey dad. Oh shit. You scared me girl. Stop it. Uh, yeah dad. You know me and you are one of a kind. We are one of the same. Dad has to go to the bathroom. Mom has to go to work. Let's get Dad to the restroom. Go ahead, Dad. Don't you want to use the toilet that you pranked? All right, Mom. What does she have to do? Work for Ella starts in about an hour. Yeah, we're going to go to work. She's not going to work from home today. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> That's the way to do it. Dance your way in the morning before you go to work or school. I think everyone should do that. Dance before work and school. Tessa is back home. Tessa is performing extremely disappointing at school. She better shape up soon. Oh boy, Tessa. Hmm. She also brought home a project. So hopefully she'll make that happened. Tessa has met Kyoshi while at school. So she met one person at school. Let's call Kyoshi over and get to know him. And Tessa's hungry, so she's going to eat. She needs to have some fun. So, yeah, let's call Kyoshi, her new person she met. And let's invite him over. Let's see, there he goes, alrighty. 
Hopefully he will come over and hang out with you, Tessa. She's like, hey, can you come over and help me with a project? All right. <clears throat> he said he would be right over. Tessa, I thought you was going to eat. Eat some eggs and toast. And let's wait for Kyoshi to come over and hang out. Here he comes. All right. All right, there is Kyoshi. Where you going, dude? You can't be just walking through people's house. He went through the front door and out the back. All right, Tessa, it's okay. We don't know what he's doing. Maybe he's a little upset. All right, he's coming back. Dude, where did you go? What's going on? He's like, my parents. He's like, you, she's like, you got problems with your parents too. Join the club. <gasps> Maybe we should ha make a club. Okay, hold on. All right, so let her talk to him and stuff like that. So yeah, let's make a club. All right, we're going to create a club. And this club is going to be called What Else? Trouble Maker Club. Okay? And it is Should it be open invitation invite only, okay? And let's see. Definitely ask Kooshi. Okay, so hopefully he will be the first member and he will. Okay, so the club hangout. There is no club hangout right now at the moment. We don't want to make it her house. And honestly, I don't know where it would be. But I'll probably have to make something in the future. Um I'll probably make something I'm not sure so for right now we are just gonna have it at her house okay and what are the requirements okay so let's add the omission rule requirement obviously is age and only teens allowed yeah only teens allowed okay troublemaker club all right where's she going she's going to do some work but let, come on, Tessa, get to know Kyoshi here and try and be friends with him. Tell some insider stories. Maybe try and calm him down just a little bit. Make a joke or something. Mom and Dad is home from work. All right, there's Mom and Dad coming home from work. Um, Ella is, uh, she's into law, and as we know, Dad is a chef, so is Dad going to be okay with Tessa having a boy over without asking permission? He just walked on by like he don't care, so, <laughs> all right, cool, they're getting to know each other. I see a couple of plus, green plus signs, definitely do some more jokes, tell a funny story. She is really tense. She wants to have some fun, I'm thinking. Alright, Mom. What's going on with Mom? Mom's uncomfortable because it's dirty in this house. She's like, I can't believe, Tessa, you came home and didn't at least straighten up. Oh, yeah. She, she got in trouble. She was about to go to jail at one point. I think she has stole something or hacked something. All right, Tessa, let's go and watch a movie and get to know Kyoshi a little bit better. Maybe your fun will go up a little bit. Oh, no. There is some red with Kyoshi. Oh, Tessa, can you get along with anyone nowadays? 
I was like, what's dad doing? He's taking a bath. <laughs> All right, mom. We're going to have mom clean up the house. Tessa and Kyoshi is, gonna, is having a movie. They're watching a movie. Repair that and clean. And she's hungry. Dad, when you come out, you're the chef, so it's time for you to cook some dinner. Let's have Dad serve some dinner. We are going to have some fish tacos. Okay, let's check in on Tessa. Tessa, stop making fun of him. This is not what you're supposed to be doing. What's going on, Bajong? Bajong? I need the kind of greasy, sticky, bad for you food you can only find at the Humor and Hygiene Festival. Want to come and get a bite with me? Who is he inviting? Is he inviting Tessa? I didn't even see. Oh, yeah, he's inviting Tessa. Tessa's face is right there. Um, yeah, so let's bring along um, Kyoshi. I mean, what's his name? Yeah, Kyoshi. And let's go hang out at the festival. You guys, we are at the High Jinx Festival. And, uh, oh no, mom is calling. Why are you calling her, mom? Hey, honey, it's mom. Obviously. Where are you going? When, when are you going to come visit lady we live with you i put all my love and effort into raising you you can at least drop by once in a while and tell your dear mommy you love her can't you oh my god i think mom yeah okay mom whatever you say mom uh i live with you i'm hanging out with my friends and i will be home on time okay all right, so <laughs> yeah, mom. Tessa's here with Bajong. Bajong, I could never say his name. They're gonna go and let's let's pick some drinks over here. We're gonna join the pranksters. She's like telling him about her parents and stuff and. Um, you know, I guess he could be kind of like an older brother, but, you know, I don't know. He's kind of creepy. I don't know. I don't know, Tessa. But she decided to come out and hang. Where, where is Kyoshi? All right. So she's drinking from the fountain. She is officially joining the pranksters. And she's going to terrorize everybody. For real. Okay. So let's. Let's prank this lady here. Let's do a funny introduction. All right, well, she's leaving. Let's do a funny introduction. Oh. Hold on. Every, let's do... Since you're sitting right here. <clears throat> oh, she came back. Is she pregnant, this lady? Oh, yeah. Oh, well... Just do friendly with her. We don't want anybody dropping babies. <laughs> oh no. Oh shoot, Tessa has to go to the bathroom. All right, so she's talking to these guys, trying to get some points for the pranksters. Once she's done with them, she will order some food. Cause she skipped out on dinner. Dad was about to. Dad was going to cook. Uh. Okay, whatever that is. Okay, go go to the bathroom. Oh no, the jokesters are in the lead by two. All right, where's the restroom? Let's just click it here. Go to the restroom. All right, Tessa, forget the food. Go to the restroom. Oh, gosh. Don't be hypnotized by this girl. Yes, yeah, she's a celebrity, but you know what? Who cares? 
Octavia. Who cares about Miss Moon? So, yeah, Tessa went to the bathroom. Is that Kyoshi? Is that why? Yeah. I can't believe things are not hitting it off with, she's not hitting it off with Kyoshi. Uh, you know, come on, girl. Always want to be the center of attention. We get it. You're famous. You're not even an A-lister, girl. You a B-lister. Like, come on. Nobody cares about you, girl. Come on, Tessa. Let's let's do some pranks. Let's make things better with Kyoshi. He seems like a pretty cool dude for you to get to know. All right, let's take a picture with him. I know Tessa convinced T is poison. Implied jokes is sabotage. Uh -huh. Okay, so that was a plus. Maybe. He, do he looks a little annoyed by it. Come on, take a picture with him. I know you don't like taking pictures, Tessa, but you're gonna have to to try and get a friend. Alright, take a picture. They actually look really cute together. She does have to end up dating more than one person um, based on my little extra challenge so we'll see what happens okay all right yeah see how quickly it went from red to green flash crazy eyes no romance yet all right we gotta prank somebody because the pranks just need some points Little pleasant. Can we prankster her? No, we don't want to be mean, but it's just a funny introduction. Okay, so they're getting along. Good. I saved that relationship. Guys, so this is the Troublemaker mini series. That is Tessa. She's hanging out at the hijinks festival she's pretty tired she hopes that in the long run she won't be a troublemaker anymore and that she will do her best to make her parents proud so thank you guys for joining me today um and you know what and i will definitely put the link up for the challenge for my extra challenge in the description so yeah okay i'm cimarella and i'm signing out i'll see you guys next time all right bye